What's up YouTube? It's Master Aquatics and I'm bringing you guys another video. So this is just going to be a really quick video about angelfish aggression. And I just really wanted to talk about one of the main reasons angelfish can be very aggressive and deadly to one another. And that's breeding. So breeding is when two angelfish pair up, they lay eggs, they just become really aggressive and they just start killing, attacking every other fish in the community tank if they are in a community tank. One of the best ways to make sure that your angelfish don't get too aggressive with each other is to always keep an eye out for your pairs. You'll know when an angelfish paired up with one another if they stay in one spot and they guard an area or a territory and they chase away all the other fish, then you know they've paired up, especially if you see breeding tubes or if you see eggs. You can easily identify a pair. I have lots of videos on how to do that. Check the description. I'll have links for those types of videos. But whenever angelfish lay eggs, you really need to be careful and you really just need to watch everything in the aquarium because that's when stuff goes down. Whenever there's eggs present and there's angelfish in a community tank with eggs, it's always negative things that are going to happen in the aquarium if you don't act fast because these fish will do everything to protect their eggs and if that means they have to fight off other fish and possibly kill them that's what they're going to do eggs and spawning is what makes angelfish really angry and just hate everything in the aquarium except themselves if you see eggs and you don't plan on taking care of the babies i would just go ahead and just get rid of the eggs and in the clips that you're watching in front of you, that's exactly what I did. Unfortunately, it's not something that I wanted to do or enjoy doing. I just know that if I'm able to destroy the eggs or get rid of them, then the angelfish will calm down and they won't be so aggressive towards each other. Now, I'm not sure if you guys can see this or not, but if you look towards the back, you'll see an orange uh, figure down at the bottom there and that's a dead koi angelfish okay this angelfish was attacked and bit and it was injured and it was stressed and bullied until eventually it was no longer able to take the beating anymore from that pair and it decided to die and of course you know it had to be one of the koi angelfish one of my favorites but, you know, what can I do? I jammed all these angelfish in the 75-gallon tank, thinking they were going to be okay. I mean, all of, everybody is okay except for that one that passed away, unfortunately. So, after this clip was shot, I did change out the water in this tank. And in the process of changing out the water, I did get rid of the angelfish eggs. For about a week, there will be peace and calm in the aquarium until they lay eggs the week after I destroyed their eggs. So hopefully they won't be too aggressive the next time they lay eggs. Anyways, my name is Master Aquatics. If you have any questions, leave them down below in the comment section. Subscribe, like the video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and bye.